I'm going to be talking about the one three three zone, and um, it's also known as the Christmas tree defense. And if you can kind of see it, there's the base of the tree, and then gradually how you get up, it kind of closes into a triangle. And so you have one mark, and then a wall of three players uh, in front of the mark. And it's kind of similar to a cup. The wall moves with the mark. And an advantage to the offense in this sense is they have a lot of space over here to make easy throws, and over here if he can break this mark. But a disadvantage for offense would be getting above this wall. Because there's a huge, it's really hard to throw in between three people right in front of you. But if they do get it above the wall, it's a great advantage for the offense because the majority of the defensive players are behind them. And so if you have all four of these people, that's 4v3, and the offense is going to take it uh, to the goal. And the 1-3-3's the three answer to this is its transition defense. And so once it gets past this wall, uh, be it a hammer or uh, a throw through the wall, they transition to man. And that's really the uh, disadvantage in this system is in the transition to man, can they do it fast enough that they cut off these throws before they just make a break to the end zone. Um, this would definitely, uh, considering field conditions in a windy, uh, in a windy tournament, it's obviously going to be hard to get a hammer across this wall. Uh, these throws are going to be easy, but you can't swing it all day, and the disc is going to get dropped.